Let's do some meal prep, but I'm gonna take it to a different level. About two pounds of beef. I'm gonna do some onion soup mix. Get that all in there. And I'm gonna cover it and power eight hours on low. That's the first meal prep. Idea complete, an onion herb. Meal two, this is gonna be for the beef mac. So while the meat is cooking, I got some sauce going. And it's got some old, uh, I'm not old, it's got some uh, pre-prepped bolognese vegetables, you know, the garlic and the basil and celery and carrots. And I added some tomato sauce, fresh tomato sauce from a can, <laughs> not homemade. And I'm gonna have that simmering for a pasta dinner that we're gonna have uh, this week. And I've got the water boiling for the macaroni because I'm gonna make macaroni and cheese to go with the ground beef that I'm cooking in the Instant Pot. Okay, so the meat is done and it's been on warm for a while. I'm gonna come in here and pull some of that macaroni that's been cooking. Okay. I'm gonna add the cheese. Okay, so I put some macaroni with the beef that was in the Instant Pot. Now I'm gonna add, you can add a cup of any of your favorite salsa or canned tomato, onions, and peppers. We have Rotel here in Texas, but I'm gonna use this today. In there, I'm just gonna Measure with my hand. Use a big chunk of this melty cheese, which is like Velveeta, and I'm just gonna leave it in there and let it get warm. It'll melt. The instant pot is on warm. The sauce is ready, and now that just it's gonna cool, come to temperature, and then I will put it in a storage box, stick it in the fridge, and then when when I come home from work, I'll throw the shells in it and heat it in the microwave. Okay, and the beef tips are still cooking. They're taking the longest, but now I'm gonna get into the chicken wings. Here's how I'm gonna do my chicken wings. And I'm gonna season it really well with my Penzi Justice Spice. I'm gonna baste them on everything I can get. And then rub. And the sauce that's at the bottom of the air fryer, I'm gonna bag it with the wings. So nothing is falling down the, the grid. Everything will be used. This is flying sauce Korean barbecue. Yum, yum. Now I'm gonna do 370 for six more minutes. Seven. Good. I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator. Those look amazing. I'm gonna let it get to a uh, room temp so where it's safe to store. And you see all that juice there? It's gonna be stored with the chicken. Let's put the sauce up. Gentle. I'll put my lid on here, my gospel, put my chicken wings in there. Okay, then I take this middle part out and that is some delicious stuff. Okay, here's my wings and my beef mac. And under here is my sauce. 